Hey, it's Letha the Divine here, my people. Just doing a really quick video. We're going to do um, a spiritual card for the day, okay? There's no timestamp specific to this. This is just as when you come run across it. So when you... <laughs> When you come across this, it's meant for your spiritual as fudge sickles. Can't use the right word for it, but I mean, well, not the right word, but you know what I mean. We can't use the word that's term. I'm using um, some really cool cards here. Okay, so spiritual as fudge sickles is what we're going to say. So when you come across this, this is going to be just a little bit of daily inspiration for today. Let me see. Oh, oh. Get this in a little bit closer. Mm. Hey, hi. How you doing? Hmm? Sorry. Okay, so I guess we're not going to talk anymore, huh? It was short lived like that. Fine. I think it actually fits really well. Did I just say fritz? Fits. It fits very well for us today. If you wouldn't say it to a friend, you shouldn't say it to yourself. Okay. This, I truly feel, is very, very strong. Um, I always say this um, in reference to, like, with my, telling myself with my friends, um, with my children, you know, like, that thing that you want so much of the best um, for, for them, right? You just want the best for them, like, regardless, you know, and you're going to be there for them. No judgment, nothing. You have their back. Well, shit, why are we not doing it for ourselves? Hmm? Water's good for you. <laughs> why are we not doing it for ourselves? So, a lot of people always ask me, well, Letha, like, it's so hard to not have negative thinking. And I get it. It's kind of like naturally instilled in us, but it's not natural to be actually like, like truthful in reference to that because people reflect their fears onto us. People will reflect on their judgment onto us. Um, I mean, na you name it, they will reflect it onto you. And so if you connect with yourself more into your spirituality, um, it helps to start changing your mindset about yourself. So, for example, we're just going to do a really quick example. For example, um, you have your best friend and your best friend's like up against a really, really hard decision. And what is it that you do? You have your talk, right? Your man talk, your girl talk, you're going to your caves, whatever it is that you do. Um, maybe you might like have your tea time or you might smoky smoky just a little bit or you might like, you know, munch out on like Rocky Road ice cream and watch movies together or whatever. And then you start connecting on that like more deep le deeper level. Right. And then you always wish the best for your friend. and You're legit like with them in the sense of like, hey, this is, you know, one way to look at it. Yeah. Like, you know, you're like, yeah, you're in the right on this one. And, you know, this is not right what the other person is doing to you and you deserve better. And. You know, I only want the best for you. Well, look at yourself in the mirror and talk to yourself that way. Or if you need help, come over to my channel um, and then, you know, let me help you with that. Because changing the mindset is humongous, humongous. And I get it. There's really hard days sometimes, you know, especially if you're sick or you have a lot on your plate or you're a single parent or you feel like, you know, all these obstacles are against you, Right. But it, it could, you know, it, it could be worse, I guess you could say. But the main point of this is, is that, sorry, I shook the table. The main point of this is, is that if you wouldn't say it to a friend, then you shouldn't say it to yourself. Okay. Tell your friend they're beautiful, then that means you're beautiful. And so getting back to the card, it says, check your thoughts with this simple test. When you catch yourself being a jerk. Respond the way you would if someone was saying that shit to your best friend, okay? Your loved one, your, you know, whoever is your freaking person. You know what I'm saying? A simple bitch, please, usually does the trick. Today, say as many bitch, please, to yourself as you need to shut your jerk side down. No more jerk sides, okay? So if you feel that urge to speak really mean of someone else, 
or our negative thoughts. And again, you guys, it's the mindset that we have to change. Oh, I can't do this and this and this. Or, you know, um, you, you know, we do it all day long. You know, it happens. So we just got to stop it. So every time, you know, we're going to break the habit and we're going to do it together. Okay. So being a jerk, we're going to stop um, being judgmental, being fearful, whatever. We're going to stop. Pretend like we're talking to our best friend, our loved one, our, you know, whoever is that special person, your God, your universe, you know, whatever it is. I look like a witch, like with all the things, like a cape. Sorry. <laughs> So laugh more, have a good time, love more, um, and keep your heads up, you know, and, and walk, you know, walk the talk, be a good person, be spiritual, and check your thoughts at the front door, please, before you enter my house. You know what I'm saying? So that was the message for today, you guys. I hope you come back to Letha the Divine to find out some more messages or check out the other little playlist that I have there. We have story time. We have the tarot cards. We have moon wishes. I think that's it for now. We might get rid of some. I don't know. We'll play it by ear, you know, because I'm a little bit of everything. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Get with this or you can get with that. You could get with this because this is where it's at. <laughs> All right, you guys. I will definitely talk to you guys soon. Love you mucho. Besos.